Hey, it's John. Welcome to another review with me. Today I'm going to do a versus video. And typically I take two things that are very similar and I compare them and tell you which one I think is better. Today, I was trying to come up with a good excuse, really, to try the Mac and Cheetos again. Um, I do already have a review up. Didn't really want to just do another just review of the same thing that I already have on my channel. But, on my way to review something else at White Castle, I noticed that they also have, during the summer, their mac and cheese nibblers. So, we're going to do a comparison and see which one is better. The White Castle mac and cheese nibblers or the Burger King Mac and Cheetos. Let's take a look at both of them side by side. There's the Cheeto. There's the Nibbler. You can see they're pretty much got the, the same area. The Mac and Cheeto is a bit thicker. You can see. They're both Mac and Cheese breaded and fried up. Let's see which one has the better taste. Start with the White Castle Mac and Cheese Nibbler. Definitely looks like a Kraft Mac and Cheese noodle in the middle there. Good crunch on the inside. Decent cheesiness throughout. Now let's try the mac and cheeto. Definitely a thicker crust to this one. The noodles appear to be like a, a wider variety of noodle. And it looks like one, two. Each one comes with five each. The the White Castle Mac and Cheese Nibblers are a dollar and eighty nine cents for five, and the Mac and Cheetos are two dollars and sixty nine cents for five. <clears throat> so the Mac and Cheetos are about eighty cents more. Do another comparison again. You're probably getting a little bit more with the Mac and Cheeto. However, I do think that's a lot has to do with the the crust on the outside. I'm gonna do a cross section of each here so you can see what I'm talking about. Break that one. Break this one. So if you look at that, the White Castle Mac and Cheese Nibbler, very thin on the crust, a lot of filling. The Mac and Cheeto, you have a pretty thick crust before you get to the Mac and Cheese in the, in the center. You can really tell in this one that you're having Mac and Cheese. You can see the noodles. In this one, it's kind of hard to actually tell what the noodles look like inside of it. Let me see if I can break it lengthwise. You can see like the noodles are short and wide. Ooh, actually one of them fell out here. So here's actually one of the noodles. It's it's a short one and it's it's wide. Whereas, and then the, the uh, these ones are a little bit longer, a little bit smaller. They actually have 
That's like a full length noodle there. And going through here, these all look the same size in the Mac and Cheetos. They're all short, fat, and wide. Now, taste wise, I think the cheese in the Mac and Cheetos is a little bit of a more of a sharper flavor of cheese. wipe these crumbs off my hands for a second. So like you can see like this is like a little bit like of a darker color than the the White Castle one is a little bit more yellow. That's a little more orange. So <clears throat> that might uh, that might mean that the Mac and Cheetos is a little more of a sharper flavor to it. which like, I can kind of taste too. So, Mac and Cheetos, the cheese flavor is a little bit better, but it's not like, it's not uh, so much better that it's like really noticeable. And at 80 cents cheaper, for the same amount, you get five in each packet. I'm gonna say the winner of this versus between the Burger King Mac and Cheetos and the White Castle Mac and Cheese Nibblers is gonna go to White Castle. You get the same amount for 80 cents cheaper, less breading, so you get more of that inside cheesy noodliness, and it's, I just think it's all, or all around better. Like the flavor of the Mac and Cheetos might be a little bit more cheesy. It's debatable. I can't really tell. It might just be the color fool in my mind to think that way. But anyway, the winner of this versus is White Castle. Until next time, guys, if you want me to do another versus, give me some suggestions in the comments below. Other than that, bye.